Today on BCPOV, the mountain bikers of YouTube converge on Whistler for Whistmas, the opening weekend of the Whistler Bike Park. But all doesn't go to plan. Daily mountain bike rider takes a digger on the first lap. Oh, jeez! My brain doesn't want to cooperate. And Skills with Phil organizes a massive train down Crank It Up. Located just two hours north of the border, many make the pilgrimage up to Whistler after a long winter. But today the weather isn't cooperating. It's been raining all night and the trails are extremely sloppy. But I'm prepared for the soggy weather and I've suited up in my best wet weather kit. Ryan the Lone Ranger, Nick from Van Can, Josh from Daily Mountain Bike Rider, and Jordan Boothmaster are waiting for me at the top. We've decided to warm up on an easier trail first. Crank it up to warm it up. <laughs> Holy crap. Wow, things are really wet. It's gonna be fun. All right, first lap. Oh, I'm getting sprayed from the Josh. <laughs> <laughs> but it doesn't take long oh, geez. for Josh to hit the ground. Holy crap! Jeez, that didn't take long, Josh. I knew I was in a bad line, but... Yeah, well you hit the tree. I did? Yeah, you went over the berm and hit the tree, I think. Did you film it? I'm pretty sure. I did film it. So yeah, he did go over that berm and he hit the tree. But what's even more impressive is he loses his glove somehow. Josh, I give you a perfect 10 for execution and keeping the tradition alive. Last year, Josh ate it on the opening day as well. Oh! Come to think of it, I think he's crashed every time I've ridden with him. Thanks for the great content, buddy. All jesting aside, Josh was okay after this and we continued with our lap. <laughs> this is going super slow. Oh, Jordan, come on. <laughs> it's always a gong show with these guys. Oh god. Oh, it's so fun here though. Still brake bumps. Somehow, still brake bumps. Just following these guys, you get so much flying up at you. Once we make it to the bottom, we've got a new visitor. Paul the punter. Gentlemen. Hey, how's it going? And of course, time for another lap. And no lineups. I guess the rain is keeping everybody away. Oh, mine's too long too. Holy shit. <laughs> After hitting up Beeline, Smoke and Mirrors, This is pretty fun. Blue Zeum. Oh yeah, wood. Nice sketchy processed wood. Oh yeah, it's sketchy. No brakes. And Wednesday Night Delight, A couple of new challengers appear. Their skills with Phil. <laughs> oh, there's Yuka! Bango Yuka! <laughs> with all the YouTubers in place, a train down Devil's Club is unavoidable. Don't break on the wood! And a bit of A line tech. Oh, it's not too bad in here, actually. <laughs> On the way back up, there's a lot of talk about Fade to Black, a double black line full of wooden features. The trail starts out with a pretty sizable drop. Phil hits it first. And then Jordan. And Van Can. Yeah. 
The next part of the trail has a drop to step up. Oh yeah. Okay. Van Can tows me into it. Fuck. Didn't feel like you had it? Uh, I should have been looking for for their head. All right, attempt number two. I follow Van Can in again. Oh, that was stupid. Damn right that was stupid. And embarrassing too. I've actually done this whole line before, but today was just not my day, I guess. That was sketchy. What did you do? <laughs> yeah. I uh, braked into the lift room to step up, and then I basically went like this. What? <laughs> to, oh. to the lip. Yeah, it was not the right thing to do. <laughs> yeah, I just, my brain just went brakes and then I braked, yeah. Feeling a little embarrassed, I head down and call it a day. Luckily, the next day was sunny. I meet up with Paul and we decide to do Joyride. Right. Two <laughs> upper. See, I've never done the lower one. Like he said, he's not done the lower section, and to be fair, it's a double block. I've forgotten how this goes. All right, like this. The sketchiest bit of Upper Joy Ride is probably this next section. I might go past it for me. Okay, sure. I'm gonna just take my time. Things are still a little wet. Oh, it's a pretty straight line, isn't it? All right, good lower joy ride. Okay, well, let's go and see if it's open, I guess. I guess. You should be like, I hope it's open. <laughs> oh yeah, it's open. Yeah. <laughs> the start of Lower Joy Ride has this big ladder roll. I show Paul how to do it as he looks on. Pretty good. It's a small step at the end, but it's not nothing that's a problem. <laughs> From here, it looks pretty massive. All right, Paul, this is his first time on Joyride. He seems a little nervous, though. Yeah! Go! Did you say go? Did you yeah, go. Huh? <laughs> go! Oh, wow. I will take this opportunity. Just, uh... Oh. You shouldn't have looked. <laughs> <laughs> Did you... I can get a thumbnail of you standing on top of it. Yeah! Nice! It's not that bad, right? Uh, it was so good. Yeah. Never nice done one. that in like four years of riding the bike path. There you go. <laughs> so there's another one coming. Oh. Right here. You want to look at it first? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> The next feature is very similar to the first one, but a bit spicier. <laughs> so yeah, you can kind of drop that lip, or I'm pretty sure roll over it. I just but like, look at the run out, it's oh, so wide. Okay, I see, yeah. I see. Yeah. Paul decides to follow me in. Oh, and by the way, that's Crank It Up down below. Oh, you got it. It's not bad, right? Oh, that's actually really chill. Yeah. <laughs> I, did, I, I even got up there and I was like, oh, I should just 
do a little drop. Yeah. I was so nervous. <laughs> Now that Paul has the two biggest features under his belt, we hit up some technical stuff. Ooh. I think it's kind of long. To monkey hands. Oh, oh, he's got the sneaky line. There we go. Oh, and a little drop. Oh, they fixed this up nice. Oh, that used to be so very bumpy. Sure it will be. And into the now massive lift line. Oh, it's so busy. Later in the day, you could join me after Paul had left. We heard that Phil was organizing a big train down Crank It Up. How's it going, dude? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Jordan and the Lone Ranger are there as well. This could get a bit crazy. Phil starts in the back and he'll try to move his way up. Uh, Eric, on your right. yeah. Oh, there he goes. <laughs> Getting rowdy. Yeah, that was sick. That was a pretty wild. <laughs> and of course, Wismus would not be complete without a lap down A line. And finally, bike park season is here after a long winter. It feels so good to get airtime again and hang out with friends. I've not been to all the bike parks in the world, but I've been to quite a few, and Whistler's pretty darn special. And for those wondering about my road trip series, there's still a few more episodes coming, so keep an eye out for those. But as usual, thanks for watching, and stay gnarly.